Let's go. Come on. Life is like a box of chocolates. It's not true what they say. You don't know what you're going to get. You know exactly what you're going to get. Whatever you buy into, whatever you went, whatever you made that purchase, whatever it is that you uh, invested in, that's what you're going to get. Just like anything. You get what you put in. So animals, your family, your, your role in leadership, whatever it is you're doing, whatever you put into you will come out. It's going to come out your mouth or it's going to come out your backside. So let's make sure the things that we're buying to, the things that are beneficial. Let's make sure they're things that are conducive to the outcome that you desire. For us, you know, we got a vision and that vision is not based on height. It's not based on opinions, it's not based on clout, it's not based on pride. It's just based on the vision, the vision that God gave us. For us, you know, God tells us, you know, we could do all things through him, you know, who but Christ, the Jesus, the one that tempted us. So this month, let's make sure because that's what you're going to get. What you're investing and what you're buying into is ultimately what you're going to get out of it. So... Stay committed. Stay committed to your vision. Continue to grow. Come on. Be patient. It all work out in due time. Everybody can't be first. Everybody can't be in the front. Many of us don't decide to be perfect. But if we all desire to invest in ourselves and our vision and our faith, uh, I can almost guarantee that all things will be possible for you. Through who? Jesus, the author, the finisher of all things in here. See this happy 4th of July for America, our day of independence. So many of us still ain't completely free. And I'm not talking about slavery. I know we all know what America's pastime is. But I'm talking about truly being free, set free, delivered. You feel me? Whole, wealthy in him. You know what I'm saying? A worthy God. A worthy God that we serve. Not a worthless God, but a worthy God. See, he's worthy. He's worthy to give us all here. But you got to be the one. Come on. Are you putting in him? Are you invested in his? In his? In his? In his? Because if you are, then his things will come. Yep, the blessings, they'll be multiplied. They'll be backed by him, you see, in your vision. The one that you're investing in, it'll pay off. See, we are invested in our vision. My vision and your vision don't got to be the same, but my vision is mine. See, my faith is mine. And in all of that, see, that's how we win. You win by what you believe in. You win by what you invest in. And far too many of us, we invested, invested in all the wrong things, all the wrong people. All the wrong places. And God wants us to be invested in him. He wants us to be true to ourselves. He wants us to be wonderfully made. Unique and specific. Different. You know, peculiar people. So let's be different. Let's embrace the different. Let's embrace each other. Let's collaborate. And stop competing. Because we're clashing. When God wants us to come together. See, this word today is for America. America. It's time for us to wake up here. Today is our day of independence, so today let's fully be free from racism, from lack, from fear, from unbelief. Oh yes, in faith, come on, let's get up and declare we got that victory, and it's in Jesus' name here. See, I pray for even my dogs and the outcome, because I know what I put into them is ultimately what they're going to give out in here. Far too many of us are leading, like pet owners, uh, any type of leader, if it's all about what they do to you and for you, when it will it be about what you do and bring out of them? See, these dogs, they're mine. I'm not sure about anybody else. Mine are in game. But I can almost guarantee if you broke into my house, if you attack my wife or my kid or any one of my children, and these dogs is in the presence, I almost can guarantee. I almost can guarantee you would have to kill them before you would be able to overcome See, and that, and that comes from 
a relationship that I built with them when they were puppies and how I protected them. Even how she just looked at me. I talked to my dogs like they're people. How else could they understand what I needed and expect from them? You see, because when it's time for them to be dogs, right? Because our dogs are companions, but they also are protective. So let's make sure whatever you invested in, the things that you're investing in are protecting your brand. See, our brand here at Y'all Gear the Movement, Holy Bills is a, is a subsidy of it. But Y'all Gear the Movement is a movement of believers, believers that believe that Christ is the king and the king is how we can be resurrected, resurrected and redeemed and re reconstructed and how we can be renewed. You see, in the faith. See, God is, God is, God is. Jesus here. Come on, have no fear. It's him, it's him, it's him, it's him. It's all about him and his here. Come on, America, America. Happy Independence Day to us here in love. Bigger than color. This is for us in here, brothers and sisters. Bigger than color in here. The faithful believers praying for the nation and the world. Yep, of Jesus and his name here. Come on, so let's be blessed. We pray for you. Hope you pray for us. And continue to understand that the choice is to collaborate and stop conflicting. Stop being in conflict. Competing. See, that chaos is not of him. See, Christ is the king, and the king wants us to come together. So this Independence Day is for his, the people of America, to come together. Come on. In the mighty name of Jesus. Be blessed and have a great day.